What's up everyone, how are you doing? My name is Philip and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing episode 3 of me reacting to software engineer portfolios uh, to some incredible websites that we saw before. I know so many of you guys were requesting for me to do a part 3, uh, so here it is. And secondly, I'd like to welcome myself back because I've been gone for quite a while, but I'm back to regular uploads. So if you do like this series, and I know a huge amount of you guys are watching it, uh, if you're seeing part three and you do enjoy it and you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button. I will really appreciate it. It really means a lot to me. And it tells me that you guys are enjoying the content and that you guys want to stick around for more. Now, without any further ado, I want to jump into these websites. We have four today, but today will be a little bit different. So uh, make sure you stick around. Let's jump into the first website and see what it's like. I'm very excited. Toyfight.co. Now, straight up, really clear, vibrant colors. Uh, very eye-catching and really, really cool uh, little... Oh, oh little uh, characters. Now, wherever I move my mouse is uh, they kind of follow, which is quite nice. It's a little bit interactive, uh, which is what we want from the website. Um, okay, Toyfight is an award-winning creative agency specializing in design. Uh, oh, that's quite cool. So uh, basically what they did is uh, they have a background, which they have some obviously images that they rendered. Uh, however, on top they have uh, an on-hover div that appears uh, which is interesting because obviously those are positioned. So I'm interested how it's going to look when we actually switch to mobile view and see if it's going to be there or what they have changed around. Uh, let's keep on going. Oh, it's a bit laggy. Recent work, toy fight. <laughs> this is cool. Uh, so yeah, a rock and roll basically. Uh, awesome. Uh, so let's continue scrolling up and see what else we can discover on this page. Uh, who? Let's, let's have a look at who. Um, who are they? Uh, I do I do like the little characters and the on hover little boxes again, which is quite cool. So let's view a bio of one of these guys and see how that looks. Napoleon Complex. <laughs> uh, so these guys, I I, th I feel like they're trying to be a little bit funny on the website, which which is working. And again, the rock and roll symbol, which is quite cool. Uh, okay, but what if I want to contact these guys? Uh, obviously, we have a contact here. Ooh, I do like that. Very minimalistic. Very simple, uh, but so nice. So if I want to click it, what? What? They have a hand? Oh, my <laughs> that is so cool. Oh my God, I'm definitely doing that on my website. So instead of the uh, hover on function that you can pick where you can select a cursor, for example, as your, as your clickable selector uh, to showcase that you can click something, they literally custom designed their own. That is super cool. And they have a hand that moves. Yeah, it, it does move. Yeah, yeah, it moves. It moves like it's telling me, hey, click me, click me. <laughs> I really do like that. That's so cool. Okay, okay. Uh, let's uh, click on what? Where is the nav? Let's click on what? Uh, what I'm starting to notice is my computer is going crazy. Uh, this is a website that's uh, quite memory and processing power dependent. Uh, and it's starting to become a little bit laggy. Um, uh, okay, so let's continue. Let's forget about the little lag. Let's see their website. Uh, 52 awards they have because they're a, a design agency, which is quite cool. Okay, and now for the test of... Uh, <laughs> I love this dinosaur. Uh, oh, look, it's like I'm moving and this guy's running away. That's quite funny. Okay, let's go and inspect and see what it looks like in mobile. Okay, so first of all, uh, this works, what they have. Let's have a look at the menu. Menu looks really good. Let's go back to the main page. Ooh, I liked that transition. That was nice. Can we do that again? Uh, okay, just loads the first page. How about if I start scrolling? Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, okay. What? There's nothing here? Uh-oh. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Guys, toyfight.co. <laughs> Award-winning creative agency specializing in design and you leave this much blank space on your website? Mm -mm -mm. No, you gotta fix that. You gotta fix that, guys. <laughs> you gotta fix it. But anyhow, uh, let's click on work and see. Uh, oh, I like those transitions. It's a bit laggy. But overall, overall, again, white space. Mm -mm. Not good. Not good. There's nothing here. There's nothing here. Oh, man. <laughs> but I, lo I love the animation, so that's great. Going back to 
uh, giving this a score. What would I give this website a score? Well, I think it's very simple. I think it's very clear. I think it is very much to the point. So these guys know what they're definitely doing. Um, so I would probably give it a, a, a solid 7 out of 10. Um, but actually, you know what? Because they're a design agency and uh, there was so much white space which they didn't get to, which is basically yes, quite simple because obviously you're designing for mobile these days. Uh, so toyfight.co, I'm giving you a 6 out of 10. And obviously the website is a little bit laggy. And of course, if you want a faster website, a better performing website, uh, you need to look at your hosting provider. You need to see how much processing power their servers can offer you. And then obviously these problems will uh, probably not happen. Okay, so now jumping onto... Re scoot up, scoot up. We've got an issue here. I'm hosting our security and that would uh, trigger me. Who are you? I'm hosting her. What do you mean and what? that triggered you? What do you mean? The, the website, the website uh, we're just viewing. It's slow, it's okay. not good, it triggered me. And uh, sorry, who are you? I'm hosting her, the best hosting service provider out there. Uh, okay, and uh, what's up? how can I help you? Well, you can't help me, but I've got something for your viewers that they might really like. Um, yeah, but this is my YouTube channel and my... <laughs> Two minutes, man. One minute. Okay. okay, so what do you want? Well, I just want to tell you that with Hostinger as a hosting provider to host your websites, okay. you're going to get extremely fast and easy to set up uh, okay. process. And it's extremely powerful. So things like this of having slow websites will not happen oh. ever. It's good, right? That sounds fairly good, to be honest. Yeah, exactly. You also get 24 hour a day, seven day a week, 365 days support. Mm -hmm. And if you don't like it, you get a 30 day money back guarantee. So what do we need to do to get this? Well, in order to get this, you just need to go onto hostinger.com slash okay. Philip. Select premium shirt hosting as it gives you a free domain, free email and much more. Choose your plan, enter your coupon code, which is Philip, and you're good to go. Ah, and then once I do get it uh, and I want to deploy my website, what do I do? To deploy a website, you go onto the HPanel easy to use interface, manage your newly created domain name, scroll down to importing a website, choose a zipped file of your built website and then click import. That's simple, man. You wanna like come back more often or something? Uh, I could if you want me to. But for now, I gotta go. So it was nice seeing all of you and free to online. What? What just happened, man? <sighs> oh dear, all these interruptions. But uh, let's jump back and let's see uh, the second website. So this guy is called Adiola. Adiola adioti.netlify.app. I hope I pronounced that right. If I did it, I'm sorry. As a first reaction, very nice, vibrant colors. It's very, you know, standout. I do like vibrant colors on websites, but I also like the minimalism. It really works together. Now, obviously, this guy's a designer and developer. Uh, this kind of reminds me of the guy that we saw in the first video of this series. Uh, I believe his name was Jacek Jezna, and he had kind of like a TikTok themed website. Uh, if you haven't seen it, you can check it out. Uh, the link will be somewhere here. And this kind of looks like it. Different colors, but kind of vibrant and nice. Uh, I'm a designer, minded front end developer based in Lagos, Nigeria. This is awesome. I love seeing people from all over the world create amazing projects like this. So stuff that I worked on. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What? Did you guys see that? What just happened? Something crazy just happened and I... Whoa, that, I, feel, I feel like that was a glitch or something, but um, anyway, the faster you scroll, the more horizontal it becomes. Uh, that's quite cool, it's a nice little effect, and obviously hover on it changes to black, and that's the stuff that he worked on. And then here are links to his social media and where to find him. And look who's here, that's him, and you can just click on this email and you get his phone number. And I think that's very, very simple website, but very clear. Now let's have a look at the menu. I always like seeing different menus because it's quite cool. I like that. Very clear, always amazing to have your resume on the website. I think it's, you know, extremely important, especially if someone goes on and they're like, mm, I like the website, I wanna know his skills. Let me check out his resume. And then they might just give you a call, you never know. Uh, so yeah, this is quite cool. I like the hover on effects. It kind of stretches the letters. And uh, let's close this. Now on to the test, Adiola. Uh, let's look at your website uh, in mobile view. Ooh, ooh. 
it's not mobile compatible, unfortunately. So you can still see everything, you can find everything, and it still has the same effects of scrolling. However, it's not mobile compatible. Not sure what this little red thing here is. Um, but let's open the menu. Maybe he got the menu right. What? I click the menu and you just get <laughs> it just gets bigger? Oh no! That's such a shame. Oh! Oh! It works! It works! <laughs> oh my god! <coughs> oh, I just choked on my own spit there a little bit. <laughs> okay, so the menu actually works. <laughs> And now it closes. Okay, so it, it, it just had to zoom in, guys. It, 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 was, it was all part of the website. It's, it's all part of the website. It, you just have to zoom in a little bit and then it's all good. <laughs> oh, that's quite funny. Uh, oh, uh, wait, what? And now it's mobile responsive? What is this red thing? What? And now it's... Now it's mobile responsive? What? So it just had to zoom in? I don't get that. That is so strange. Um, I have never come across anything like that. Usually when you put it into mobile view, it just it just works uh, <laughs> That's quite funny though. Okay, so uh, Really simple really easy to understand website lots of information everywhere uh, Little text. I love it vibrant colors interesting. What do I give this website? I'll give you a solid 7 out of 10 it's it's honestly very good. So really big well done Adiola uh, For a minimalistic website you did a really good job Jumping onto the third website now, uh, Adrian Gervais. I hope I pronounced that right. Now, this website, oh, I love this blue color. I think it's very kind of a startup, like a 2021 startup theme, uh, very simple. And I'm a freelance designer turning your paper bowl into paper plane. That's really cool. And then here he just gives you a little, uh, I guess, a little information what he does. And a nice little email. Ooh. Ooh, no, no, no. I don't like this click to copy. The color is okay, but I don't like this click to copy. Rather than click to copy, what he should have done is uh, change the icon here to a copy icon. Uh, that would have been much smoother, I think. Uh, because this is a little bit... It's it's not like, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's like the cherry on the cake. It's just not there. But other than that, let's keep scrolling and see what we find. Uh... Oh yeah, yeah. I told you this is very startup 2021. It's kind of has the same same theme to it, redesigning the experience of e-learning platform. So he has everything kind of set up. One, two, three, four. I do like that. That's really nice. Services and contact. What does it say in here? What is this coffin? Do I click on it? Portfolio already outdated. Expiration date 20. How do you have an expiration date? Why why are you not changing this, uh, Adrian? It's already 2021. You're a little bit uh, outdated. That is true. <laughs> uh, but it's good. I do like that. It's very clear. Uh, what about the menu? Where do we have the menu? Is this the menu? No, back to home. Ooh, I, I do like the paper aeroplane flying in. That is quite satisfying. And it's right there. Okay, about and services. I guess this is his main menu. Hello, I'm Adrian. I'm building digital experience interface. Hi, Adrian. Uh, <laughs> okay, past experience. And yet again, we have a resume. It's a thing that you want to do. It's I, I want to know what's on his resume. Uh, I want to know what he did. I want to know his experience. And this is really nicely set out. See how clear this website is to read? Uh, it's awesome. And again, interested, let's get in touch. Always have a get in touch everywhere. Uh, you don't want to have people miss out on... Um, on getting in touch with and he has no menu it's it's so simple but it's so nice it's it's one of those examples where there is no menu that's needed you have one page you have the other page and that's everything now uh, mobile responsiveness of course yes uh, let's inspect this page and yes of course as i assumed it would have been mobile responsive uh, maybe this little circle of ui ux uh, a little bit misplaced and uh, maybe this paper airplane a little bit overlining the paper plane the header However, it seems that everything else looks really good. No, I do like that. That's quite nicely set out. Everything is clear, spaced out correctly. And obviously, 
everything else is quite nicely done. So yeah, well done, Adrian. That's really good. Um, how would I rate this website? Well, I think uh, props for not having a menu. I guess you've been able to put everything on the same page. A really nice color work, cool animations, very simple, uh, very eye-catching. Uh, you know, I'd probably give you a, a good uh, 7.5 out of 10. Really nice website. Uh, and as always, guys, comment in the description below what you think of these and how would you rate them. Uh, I'm interested. This is just my own personal opinion, of course. Uh, but I think this one really does stand out nicely. Okay, and now on to the final website called Sanju.in. Sanju.in. It's loading. Sanju. Hello, world. I'm K. Sanju Singha. Okay. A creative digital marketing freelancer in India. Hey, awesome. I know a lot of my viewers are from India. What I can tell already, I reckon this is going to be a, a white minimalist website. So just black and white colors, nothing else, uh, and super simple and minimalistic. So let's see if I'm right. Uh, I love to communicate with people from my work. More about me, some information, uh, years of freelancing, how many website design, 15 plus, and 100% for digital marketing. And he has this little helper where you can kind of send him a message, uh, which is quite nice. It's usually on bigger websites, not on personal portfolios, but I guess this uh, guy did it. Wait, what? <laughs> Marketing? Oh my God, marketing? Marketing? <laughs> I love that, that is super creative, what I do. Okay, and he tells you what he does. Oh man, creativity, creativity, that's so cool. <laughs> that's really awesome. Uh, I have never seen anything like that before. That is super creative. Uh, so obviously black and white website, what stands out is the little pictures. Uh, is he gonna have more? Recent work. Uh, oh my God, productivity, productivity. <laughs> this is so cool, oh my God. This is actually very, very cool. Uh, and let's collab. If you are starting a business or stuck in the middle and looking for a creative digital marketer to develop your business, blah, 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 contact me. Awesome. Made with love by Sanju. Okay. No, I, I really like those headings. Let's have a look at his menu. Nice and simple pop-up. I'm seeing these are becoming much more trendy now, where rather than it taking a whole page down, you just get a, like a little pop-up uh, saying, hey, you know, here are the links and here's my social media, go send me a message or whatever. Uh, it's becoming much and much more popular. Now, Sanju, I'm going on to inspect and I, and I expect you to have everything mobile responsive and clearly Sanju has thought of it and he does. And that's really nice. See how that changed, this little pop-up? Uh, let's scroll down. I want to see those animations working nicely. And they are. Oh, unfortunately, they're not animated, but, you know, uh, we'll let him off. <laughs> this is super cool. Uh, I really, really like this one. It's, it's so simple. Uh, and you know what you'd never think, black and white, uh, very simple colors, and yet uh, it can really be impressive. Uh, so uh, really, really nice work, Sancho. Uh, as to do with the rating, I'd probably give him an 8 out of 10. Honestly, uh, I feel like it's harder to create a website so plain but so interesting uh, than something put a lot of effort and colors and everything into something to make it interesting. This was interesting, this was catchy, it was funny. Uh, everything you'd probably want from a personal portfolio. So really nice work. That's all the websites I have for today. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you got to the end, make sure you smash the thumbs up button. Uh, and also make sure to subscribe to my channel because I'll be releasing a lot of these videos soon uh, of web developer reacts to certain websites. Uh, I also might do a reaction to your guys' personal portfolios. Uh, I will set up a little poll for that where you'll be able to post your links and I will uh, try and review them live uh, or on a video. You never know. So make sure you subscribe. But for now, guys, as always, thank you very much for watching. It's awesome, you know, seeing you here. And I will see you in the next video. Bye. I spend my Mondays like Fridays. I spend my Fridays in a box. In my heart, I'm my whining. I put my pinings on pedestals to the keep when I'm grounded. What's that mountain to nothing? Let's make some something from nada. Let's go to Gucci and Prada. 